Greetings travellers. In this vid I'd like to show you how to make this black bamboo decoration for your base. Black bamboo is a thing and I use these pictures as a reference. I'm building the bamboo one short wall below the floor so when I put the floors back it will be embedded in the floor. I'm also putting a couple of small timber panels on the roof as anchor points. So the bamboo is made from an enlarged supply pipe. So first let's build a sample piece that we can copy later. And then we want to make a scaled up electrical wire at the correct size. And for that I'm using the locker and two wooden walls. So put the locker against the wall and then select wire mode and start building the wire. But before you finish building the wire, toggle back to the locker and then scale it up to the lower part of the second wall like this. And then we press the toggle wire and the build button at the same time to make a scaled up wire. Then copy the supply pipe and store it in the cache by pressing the toggle wire and the toggle build button at the same time. And then we copy the large wire build a section and then we press the toggle wire and the build button at the same time. You can build it thicker or thinner if you wish but I found that this thickness was just about right when we start adding the leaves a bit later. I also went two walls high uh, just because the longer the supply pipe the further apart the little ridges are. I think the scaled up or down supply pipes are a bit of an underutilized element of glitch building and they can be really handy as you can see here with this kitchen design or these tatami mats I made for my recent base the onsen hot spring resort shameless plug so now let's get our leaves ready for this we're going to use the dwarf palm we'll just shrink one down to its smaller size and build one and as you can see the stem of the bamboo is thick enough to hide the base of the dwarf palm but we can't actually embed it correctly so that base part is hidden and we also have a problem with cascade deletion so if we delete the pipe we can see that the dwarf palm will also disappear so what we're going to have to do is build the dwarf palms first and then place the pipe later I also use the bio lanterns for a bit of extra atmospheric lighting, so maybe make one of those two at the smallest possible size. As you can see here, the left and right ribs of the wall light almost perfectly line up with the left and right supply pipes. So we'll use these as guides. And then after removing the pipe, we place one wall light on the floor and then another one above it on the roof. The lights don't need to be directly above each other, in fact, if they're a little bit off and the bamboo is a bit crooked, it actually adds to the naturalistic effect. I'd recommend starting from the wall and then working forward. So then go ahead and select an electrical wire and build it from the left hand rib in the middle up to the corresponding rib above. And then copy your dwarf palm and place them randomly on the front of the wire. Use that little white dot on the bottom of the dwarf palm to make sure that it is lined up correctly on that wire because if it's a little bit off it will be very difficult to hide it with the bamboo later. You can go ahead and put a bio lantern on there as well but I suggest you don't use too many of them as it actually can detract from the effect if you use too many I think. And I strongly recommend making a restore point before you place every new piece of bamboo just to avoid those cascade deletion issues if you have to remove it and try again. And now we take a copy of the supply pipe and build it on that front center rib of the wall light. And then line it up with the corresponding rib on the top light and uh, do your best to tweak it so it covers the stem of the dwarf palm but still keeps the leaves sticking out. Unfortunately, you'll probably have to leave the wires there and hide them with the electrical cloaking device uh, because they can also cause cascade deletion issues. 
You can actually put wires on the left and the right side of the wall lights and put foliage on the left and right stems, um, but it is a bit trickier to get the supply pipe to engulf both the left and the right dwarf palm bases. I've kept it simple as best I can for this demo, but if you want to give it a try, go for it. So go ahead and fill in a couple of the gaps with some of the regular size supply pipes, just to give a bit of a, a variety of thickness. And now we're ready to put the flooring back. And I think the stone flooring and the stone walls uh, contrast really well with the black bamboo. couple of rocks to keep with the organic motif and then a couple of lanterns to give that little bit of extra backlighting. So there we are, there's a fun little interesting decoration for your base. And if you've enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, thanks very much for watching and we'll see you later.